Man. Hello, Mike Toes. I wanted to talk a little today about something that really makes me mad. And what makes me mad is paying for someone else's bitch. I've talked about this before. Paying for someone else's bitch. There is a picture of my old basin. When I rented my house, I came back and I had a party. And the thing is, at that party, two deviant people had sex in my sink basin and cracked it. Well, this is what I call paying for someone else's bitch because I had to work a week to replace the sink basin. That's slavery. Someone decided to have sex in my sink basin and I had to pay for it. So let's talk about this. How many ways in your life do you end up paying for someone else's bitch? See, I end up noticing this a lot in life, and it's not just incidences like this. It's other incidences in life where you're on the job and you end up paying for somebody else's bitch. One incidence I like to talk about is a donation I gave to somebody. Most of the time, it's irresponsibility where you end up paying for someone else's bitch. Uh, I took in a couple here that had a hard time once, and uh, he started working and uh, wasn't paying the bills, wasn't paying all of his bills. And his excuse most of the time was, oh, I had to take the wife out, I had to take the kids out, I had to do things for her. And uh, somehow I was supposed to understand this. Somehow I was supposed to pay for the bitch and understand this. When the bills are due and you take your girl out to the bar or buy her a new dress or something like that and you leave your buddy stuck, he's paying for your bitch. Now I see this at work too. A lot of times a man will come in and say, I got to do something, I have to go to a wedding or I have to take my wife somewhere and uh, you end up doing overtime. Well, you're paying for somebody's bitch in another way. You're paying for it with your body. And sometimes you pay for it monetarily at work. He needs overtime. He needs to, more money to take her out. He needs to do this. So the boss says, well, that's great, Jim, or that's great, Bob. You take your girl out. I'll give you the Saturday to work, but Joe, he won't get the work because you're going to get the overtime, Bob. And then you end up paying for somebody else's bitch. This happens in society an awful lot. In our laws, we end up paying for somebody else's So, how many times have you noticed this at your job? How many times have you walked in and seen that the boss was in a relationship with a woman? He was getting a Hummer or a BJ. How many times did he place her interest in front of yours? How much did that cost you in life? I assume in my 50-some years of life on this planet that I've ended up working about a year, maybe a year and a half, paying for someone else's bitch, paying for someone else's pleasures. So the other man, and men do this to other men, they expect you to help out. You have to pay the bill at the bar. Sometimes when she orders a drink and it's your turn to buy, and it comes around to her turn, she will not reciprocate the act of paying for the beverages. You often end up paying for her burger. Your boss will often end up giving her benefits at a job for a job not very well done or a desk job. So she can sit in front of him and he can visualize that act all day long while you're working hard. This happens often in our society. This happens in our laws. This happens in your work. This happens in your home. Once you start visualizing 
the concept of paying for someone else's bitch, you'll be able to spot it in your life and you'll be a safer person. Because you're going to start to refuse to pay for those things. Like I do now. I don't have couples in my house anymore. I don't let people come in my house. I don't let women come in my house that are going to ruin it, destroy it, take it over. And then someone's going to end up paying for that after they ruin a house that workmen have built. In society, this happens a lot. Look for it, men, and have a great day. Think MGTOW. Don't pay for someone else's bitch. Have a great day. Thanks a lot, MGTOWs.